Hello my friends, welcome again. In this video I'm going to start a new series with the Laravel and we are going to create a Laravel admin panel with the help of a Spotty package called Laravel permission and has 9000 stars in the GitHub repository is used by 23.7k and 10 million downloads okay it's a very good uh, package and you can go to the github or docs.spotted.b and here you have the version 4 introduction the documentation okay for that I'm going to install new Laravel uh, I'm going to create new Laravel uh, application and if you go to the Laravel documentation uh, here is how you can install you can install with uh, docker you need to have the docker desktop here and just run this command and give it the name here or in my case I have uh, the valet and I'm going to and I have installed the Laravel installer so just Laravel new and give it a name. I have, uh, I am in the directory where I want to install the, uh, the application and I'm going to call it Laravel new uh, Lara admin the name and hit enter and it's going to create a new Laravel application for us. Okay, the application is ready, so CD in the Lara admin. And here we are. And first of thing, I'm going to install the package from uh, Laravel. And here we have a, to install the breeze or jet stream, but the breeze is more. Uh, and just composer require go there around this and php artisan breeze install after that okay now we need to run the npm install and npm run dev okay You can install the breeze with the inertia if you want. I'm going to open a new terminal and cd to Lara uh, admin and when and go here and go to installation in Laravel uh, copy this one go to the terminal and I'm going to zoom but maybe you don't see this yeah I run this one compose requires party Laravel permission okay after that you need to this is optional that inside the providers this one Uh, it's uh, inside the okay so inside the config app php at this one and i'm going to add the app php uh, Pick up PHP and inside the providers. Here we have the providers, and I'm going to add it here. 
Okay, and you can. Sorry. Render publish that. Okay, and after that we need to run the PHP artisan optimize clear. Okay. We install the Laravel, pack, uh, Laravel permission package and go to the basic usage. And I'm going to open the table plus to create new database for this application. Okay, create this uh, min. And hit enter. Yeah. I'll open the env file here and now the name, yeah, the name is Lara Admin, so I am okay. And to use this package we need to add this as roles in the user class and go here and open the user model okay and add here use or just add here as roles and import the uh, has role trait here okay and we are done now we can use this package and this is how we can create the package a role create the name name and give it the name of the package so first I'm going to run the artisan migrate uh, why is there admin? I think we have created this and no uh, I rename this because okay I'm going to create another one Lara admin and now if you go here and run the migrate yeah and open this Lara admin Close this one, and we have uh, users here, roles, role has permission, permissions, uh, model has roles, model has permission, and all of that, because we installed the, the permission package, and you go to the permission table, create permission table, you see here we have uh, the schema for create the permission table another one for create the roles uh, model has role permission model type uh, sorry uh, model has roles and role has permission okay and now to create the First of all, I'm going to open the Tinker here, or we can uh, create with the artisan command like this and give it the name. And I'm going to create 
one for admin another one for uh, user basic one another one for the writer and I think we are okay what we can have our admin user writer and maybe another one for the editor and if we go here now inside the roles yeah we have a admin user writer and editor okay and I think uh, for this video we are done we set up the application if you go to the Lara admin dot test here is our application we can register and after we register we can log in but for this video we are okay so see you in the next video if you like please like and subscribe my channel thank you very much and see you soon